Yo, what's up guys, Nesquik here. This is a video about someone I wanted to rant about for a while now, and I'm doing it. Trust me, this person is a very disgusting person. But before watching my video, please subscribe and like the video or else I'll kidnap your pet sandwich. So just do it like Nike. This video isn't sponsored by Nike, by the way. So imagine wanting to be an influencer on Instagram. What content do I want to post on Instagram associated to my brand? What should I post on the internet to make the world a better place? How do I make people happy? Should I post inspiring quotes? Nah, 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 nah. Should I post about my workout routine and post my progress to losing weight? Maybe. I don't know. Maybe I should post artwork and good drawings or make good music. Or better yet, I should post content that brings out good influence to anyone who watches it. Nah, I'm not really a creative or good enough to be posting all that. I know what to post. Imagine yourself going to a mall, you shop for clothes, and you mind your own business, and you're enjoying yourself until you see this. Can someone call animal service to take this hippo to the freaking zoo? Like, literally. And I'm obviously not ranting about her because of her skin color or her obesity before I get canceled. I'm ranting about her because of what you just saw. This is honestly super disturbing. The first time I heard about her and watched one of her videos, the one she eats her own shit, I almost puked on my burger. And yes, I almost did. She's nastier than a pig. And not only she has done those things, she also has gone naked in the streets and in her live videos on Instagram. She even drank her own period blood. She even brags about having a lot of STDs like if they were accomplishments. Literally, she is the embodiment of the word disgusting. But things can get worse, right? She also gave birth to a child. Now, I don't know how the hell a person like her can bring a child into this world in such a state like hers, but apparently she did. But like I said earlier, things can't get worse, right? Apparently, they do. I have spit in her fucking face. Like, you are literally, my daughter is literally a piece of shit. And I hate her so fucking much. And like, people just don't understand, like, I hate that bitch. She's just a piece of trash. And my main goal in life is to give my baby the worst life possible. This, this is just too far. Not only she's literally disgusting, but also disgusting as a human being. She is both aspects of disgusting. Why did she even give birth to her when she just hates her own daughter? I just don't understand this. I clearly don't. She's the most obnoxious person I've ever met. Better yet, the most obnoxious person on the goddamn internet. She's just disturbing. It's as if the word disgusting and evil had a baby and this is their child. But thankfully, she doesn't have custody of her child from what I've heard. And honestly, I'm so glad she doesn't have custody of her child. But since there is no child to torture for clout, she instead tortures and from what I've heard, killed animals and posted them on social media. Max, are you ready to be barbatized? Queen Nicki Minaj's perfume. Max, are you ready to be barbatized? Are you ready for me to fucking spray perfume on your eyes because of the horrible, trashy, cloud-chasing as person I am? Are you? Because I am. At this point, I'm just so fed up with her. I just wanted to let it out, dude. She's ugly inside and out. This is literally what happens when you aren't raised by a dad. And I bet you that her family is beyond disappointed at her. If I was her parent and I saw all of this, I would disown her and she would be dead to me. Honestly, she should change her name from Lovely Peaches to Nasty Peaches because let's be honest here, she isn't even lovely at all. I got more alternative names for you. Rotten peaches, nasty cheeses, stinky cheeses, shitty peaches, anything but lovely peaches. Apparently, she also sings. I forgot to mention that. So let's see one of her videos, shall we? Fire ass intro, not gonna lie. Whoa. 
What in the shot by iPhone shit fuck is this? <laughs> you see that look in her eyes? I can't really tell she wants to eat him so bad, dude. I like, nom 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 nom. Delicioso. Anyways, let's continue with the video, even though I'm not gonna show the whole video. That's a very nice view. Anyways, let's just skip to the part where she just goes crazy. Holy fuck, that's actually scary. Imagine yourself walking down the streets, then this smelly, stinky hippo just randomly goes on top of you. She does have talent, I have to admit that, but unfortunately, all her talent is being wasted. But yet, yeah, there's something that I really hate, and it's the fact that there are people who support her despite doing all those atrocious acts that she posted on social media. They even support all the disturbing things she's done. There was a time, which was last year, that she even had the blue icon every celebrity has. Like, dude, how? She even has tons of fan accounts, and I mean tons of fan accounts, who I don't know act like a fucking cult who worship their obnoxious dog shit, disgusting, no-life, nasty, hippo whale-looking-ass goddess who does nothing more but post disturbing, shitty, disgusting, useless-ass content onto the internet. Whether they support her as a joke or for real, they can't support her. They shouldn't support her in the first place. I bet you $10. If you show this to a five-year-old and you tell them all the things that she has done, they would instantly have the face of disgust and they're going to point out that she's just wrong and nasty. But nope, these are either white 15-year-old girls or grown-ass 20-year-old women who don't take anything serious. Honestly, I don't know if she's doing all those nasty acts for clout or if she's being for real. First off, if she's doing all that for clout, dude, please, you're a fucking grown-ass woman who should go to work, get fucking bread, and live a normal life without disturbing people. Or, if she's doing all that for real, then she should go to an asylum and take her meds. Nah, you know what? She should be locked up in an asylum, dude. She should be locked up in there and take her meds and have a miserable life because of all the things she's done. Even if it's for clout, that's not really entertaining, dude. Like, honestly, it's not entertaining. It's disturbing and nasty. I just got over her. Totally. Apparently, this cancel culture nowadays canceled the wrong people. Why don't they cancel her? But just like a famous random YouTuber said, and I quote, we're evolving but backwards. This is the first and last video that I'll ever do about her, unless she reacts to my video, but what can I say? Anyways, that's all for today guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Take care and have a nice day or night. Peace out.